Justin Best, class of 2023, center field, Philly scout team, combine academy. I'm committed to Florida State, and this is what's in my baseball bag. What's up, guys? I'm Hype, and I had to jump into this video real quick to ask for a huge favor. Over 85% of the 1.3 million views that were viewed on this channel last month were not subscribers. So if you do me a huge favor and hit that subscribe button if you're not already subscribed, and if you are subscribed, hit that thumbs up button. It's a huge help on growing the channel. And the bigger the channel gets, the better the videos. Thank you so much. Now back to the video. So this is the PG American bag I got from Chase Field in Arizona. So my parents got me this glove probably about a year ago. I'm starting to break in now for the senior season. This is a pro preferred Rollins customized glove with the EC the Justin Best 7 and the ECJ base right here. This is a 12 and 3 force. Really nice colors, uh, super comfortable, and it's not that hard to break in. This is a glove I've, I've really been using a lot the whole entire summer circuit, uh, even during school while this past year, the uh, Wilson Day 2000. Uh, this is probably a 12 and 5th. Um, like I said, this, this is also very durable. I mean, this thing doesn't drop too many baseballs. And I just love the webbing when you catch the ball from somebody. We have the Evo Shield Lay Guard, the uh, Wilson Premier Laces. I use this uh, Lay Guard this past summer with the Philly Scout team because it's, of course it's all rare, so you gotta match with the Philly Scout team. As you can see, I kind of ripped off. I've had this thing for probably about two years. And this is the elbow guard that goes along with the uh, Lay Guard. The laces, as you can see, the symbol. Next thing we got, the LV Lumber Bat. This is a 3330. Uh, this is my practice bat. You know, I kind of like to, you know, get the fill of the barrel for this. My game bat is a Chandler bat also, which is a 3330. Um, this bat is extremely hot. I would recommend kids to swing this bat if you have a lot of power, because, you know, this it can go really far if you connect with it, if you're a really strong kid. This is, this is a new bat I recently got. This is actually the bat I'm gonna use this senior season called the Victus Knox 2021. I swung it good this past season, but I figured that the Victus Knox, in my opinion, and people could disagree or agree, agree with me on this, but I think this bat is better than the goods. Say in the comments. This is my trainer bat. I have a, I have a bigger one as well. It's in the trunk. This is a Kenwood bat. This is for uh, barrel control and staying through the barrel pad as long as possible. So I start with, you know, my my bottom hand to, you know, I, I work on opposite field and then top hand, you know, I work right back up the middle and then I get with the bigger bat that I have with this one and just no stride to use my upper half and just hit the ball up the middle with it. This is also a practice bat, the Old Hickory uh, 3330. I got this bat from Jupiter last year from my Old Hickory rep. It's an extremely hot bat, like I said. I also recommend you guys to swing this bat as well if you're in Old Hickory. So, uh, yeah. These are my cleats. 
that I use from the, uh, the East Coast Pro Professional Showcase we got this past summer. Uh, East Coast Pro is a um, week long showcase where you showcase yourself in front of professional scouts and you, you get to play against the best pros all across the country and you see the best arms, the best bats, best catchers, etc. So, I mean, I, I do need a new bat to keep my cleats in. Uh, this is a USA Baseball bat I keep all my cleats in, but I'm gonna change that bag here pretty soon. Practice batting gloves, the Franklin batting gloves. Um, they last for a very long time. I, when it comes to batting gloves, I recommend you getting a pair that lasts for a very, very long time. I mean, I just see I use them today, but I mean, they do have a hole right now, but they still kind of last long. So I, I use tape for my hands because I get a lot of uh, blisters. So that kind of, the tape kind of prevents blisters that I use. And this is the tape that I've been, that I just recently just mentioned that I use, but I, I probably ran out, so I'm gonna get some more here pretty soon. And we got some water in here, because you gotta stay hydrated before and after the games and before you go to bed. Stay hydrated, kids. That's it.